Tranquility Base here. Tranquility Base, Tranquility Base. Tranquility Base. Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. Well, the moon is an interesting place in its own right. We have barely scratched the surface scientifically and preserved in the lunar regolith, which is a, a fancy way of saying moon dirt, preserved in the lunar regolith is the history of the early uh, development of our planet, planet Earth. And we can go to the moon and figure out a lot of what happened in the early history of planet Earth. How do you basically create a self-contained habitable volume that you can actually deliver to another planetary surface, basically set it up, get it running, and actually have a capability similar to space station where crews will actually be able to come and go over periods of time. We have uh, several areas of interest right now. Either one of the polar regions seems to be really interesting for a number of reasons. One, there's a near continuous solar light at the poles, so it makes using solar power quite attractive for powering your lunar base. Another aspect of living near the poles are these regions that, that appear to be permanently shaded, and these can collect uh, space volatiles, things like water. Lay them out with certain variations as the Bioplex model had intended. Uh, the, the, the central portion here uh, is the uh, hygiene area, shower, uh, lavatory. Material of the of the same sort. I'll try to get a rock in here. A couple. 